Hi, this is Samantha from Prepped and Polished. Thanks for joining us today. Today I'm going to show you how to tackle the first part of the relationship analysis questions on the SAT chemistry subject test, the true-false. First, what does the relationship analysis question look like? They will give you two statements joined by the word because. You'll have to evaluate each statement separately to determine whether it is true or false. Let's look at a real example from the College Board website. Statement one reads, the combustion of fuels containing sulfur leads to the production of acid rain. Sulfur oxides do combine with atmospheric water to form an acid solution that will precipitate out as rain. From chemistry, we know this first statement is correct. It's true. However, the College Board does not want to test you on hypothetical situations or outside knowledge that may negate this statement. They're not asking if you know about industrial scrubbers, which may capture the sulfur oxides before they reach the atmosphere, or about acid snow. No, they want to test you on whether you know the chemistry behind this broader statement. Keeping this in mind, let's examine the second statement. Sulfur oxides do form acid solutions in water. The chemistry supports it, and we can label this one as true as well. Now that we have two true statements, we need to determine whether the second statement is a correct explanation for the first statement. This can get tricky, so we've devised a part two of this video to lead you through the process. Now, believe it or not, students get so caught up on getting to the correct explanation that they sometimes just read the statements and jump to that part before determining whether the statements are true or false. If you seem to be having this problem, we recommend that you read and evaluate the second statement first. This breaks it apart from the because and stops the tendency to want to read ahead. Thanks for watching our video on tackling the true-false portion of your relationship analysis questions on the SAT chemistry subject test. Next, please check out our video on part two, the correct explanation process.